Hey guys, how you doing? Mike Hennig back here with more Rome 2 Total War playing the DEI mod as the Roman Republic. Now, the Senate on my Discord has been somewhat busy. I put up to a vote how we are to proceed going about attacking Carthage, uh, whether we were going to do a straight declaration of war or join the war through Syracuse to score some points with uh, the Greeks here and probably just make it easier to eat them up. Uh, later on, but um, it was overwhelmingly voted that we will do a straight declaration. Uh, we are going to let them know that we are Rome and we don't need an excuse. We don't need to help help a friend out who's not really our friends. We need Panormos and Acragas and all of your other junk as well. So that's how we are going to proceed with that. Now, the other matter for debate was how are we going to defend our homeland with our best three legions gone? Uh, I mean, look at this. We got uh, Legio 3 Italica. We got Legio 2 Adiutrix and Legio 1 Apollinaris. Uh, this represents basically all of our martial forces except for uh, our legion up top here, uh, Legio 5 Venaria. And we'll deal with them in a sec, but... Um, between Senators uh, Tiberius Tullius and Senators Formis Persides, uh, we compromised on strengthening this legion, uh, Legio IV uh, Liberatrix, because we can get um, Roman forces with this. Uh, you know, we have the best recruiting area right here, and there's some really interesting and kind of kick-ass choices we got in here um, that we'll go through when the time comes. Uh, so that is what we're going to do. So we'll have Legio 4 here. Uh, well, I mean, this guy is just really more of a quality of life for Roma and Latium as a whole general. Just kind of sprucing things up there with a lot of his skills and talents. Uh, whereas this, Legio 5 Veneria, uh, this is our Barbarian Legion. It's, it's the wild regions up here. And uh, it was also suggested by Senator Noob Slayer that this be renamed uh, Legio 5. I believe it was Barbaricum. Was it? I will double check. But yeah, it is fitting. Now, as a Roman, you would not want to be in charge of this legion. This would not be a good stepping stone on your career path. But if you guys recall, we have one character who I just want nothing good to happen for the rest of his life. Uh, that is Decimus Gabinus, Gabinius Dento. He was the admiral that fled during an otherwise winnable battle, costing us victory, costing manpower, costing lives of the brave Roman sailors, and worst of all, leaving a stain on Roman honor, where they just laughed at us. So... Uh, it was suggested by uh, Long Yu that perhaps we use this guy as a diplomat, quote unquote, uh, to send to some of the rougher elements. Now, now that we are at peace with um, the very forces, the very faction he fled from, why not send him over there? Since, I mean, they hate us bad. They hate us real bad. Now, if he ends up crucified or you know, burnt at the stake, it would be a damn shame. Uh, because if this doesn't work, this is where I close the loop here, then uh, he is going to be in charge of the Barbarian Legion for a while while I try to convince him uh, to execute himself with this button here. Yeah, the suicide button. Uh, I'm going to do everything in my power to get him killed and or maimed and just nothing good happening. So I wanted to catch up on some of the events and what some of you guys are doing uh, to help out the campaign, which I really appreciate. So uh, thank you all for that. Now, uh, back to business here. Uh, we are... Now, while we're still in Roman lands, are there any units that we want to replace? Ooh... We could get some Apulian heavy infantry, huh? Uh, what kind of weapon do they have? Are they axemen?
All right. Uh, well, is there anything that I'm kind of iffy on? Not really. Unless we could get some better skirmishers than what we have. These levies are not necessarily the best. Um, okay, we could get... I'm not even going to try to pronounce that, but the Lucanian skirmishers. Uh, they have missile damage of... 21. And can we even... Oh, yeah, right here. Levies, duh. Uh, who's better? Oh. Okay, well, yeah. Um, the Lucanians have higher melee attack and defense. Better charge bonus. Better weapon damage. Everything else is the same. So, why wouldn't we? And I do want to kind of... I've been meaning to get more uh, auxiliary forces into our legions to, to, you know, to better represent what, uh, a Roman legio at this time would be. Uh, there's always auxiliaries from allied states or people pressed into friendship with Rome. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Excellent. All right. They're done moving. What about you guys? Uh, we got three legions in the same in the same province. That is not really good. Uh, can I get these guys out? Yes, I'm going to. I want hourly there we go. Alright, we'll send them up there. Faster, you and you'll patrol. Now, we are really screwed food-wise, so I'm gonna have to stop tax harvesting and import food. It'll be plus five food, and that's really going to ding whatever livestock income we have, but it'll also bump up the growth, so we're going to do that. That's plus five food. We're minus six now, but we can probably steal some to get by. Can we not? Where is, where, where are spies? Where's my spies? Uh, here we go. Postumia, what are you doing? You are not stealing food, but you also... Okay, yeah, you're exploring uh, Iberia. Let's go ahead and do that. Where are you going? Okay, that's fine. Steal foods. All right, that's an extra two food for us. Uh, Hostilia Celania. Where do I need you to go? Uh, let's steal from the Tulingi. I really don't mind. Barbarians. They the way they eat is revolting anyway. They don't they don't deserve it. Uh oh, and you can't steal food. Damn. Okay. Well, it looks like everyone's just gonna go hungry for a turn. Or actually no. Um that import food edict will uh will pop in. Uh now the other thing that I was asked about by Senator Forme's Procedes was our relationship with Athens and uh, the Ptolemies, Ptolemaic Egypt. Um, so it was suggested that for these guys, I have a non-aggression pact at friend. least in place and a trade speech. agreement, which of course we have. Agreement. And for Egypt, uh, I don't think we're going to get a... Uh, we are trading with them, but I don't think we're going to get a non-aggression pact out of them without paying a lot of money. Like a lot of money. And I think that is because they're at war with so many damn factions. Oh, yeah, with uh, Kyrenike here. Ooh, that's too bad. So they're they're getting it from both sides, so... You know what, I'm not actually too concerned about getting a nap with them, just based on that. Okay, Renike, aren't you... Oh, so they're not long for this world. They're at war with both Carthage and Egypt. Not a smart move. Okay, and Carthage is currently at war with uh, two factions in Iberia. Syracuse, Epirus. So yeah, all right. I feel pretty pretty good about how we're proceeding here. Oh, now she can steal food? No, she can't. 
Okay, that's fine. Uh, anything else we want to do? We have a lot of money. We have a lot of money. Uh, we have 20k. Let's see. Latium. Didn't I just tell you? Okay, yeah, you're going to switch to import food. Uh, oh, we can't get another edict down here. All right, so that's all done. Now, what have we up here? Uh, we can upgrade our M4 makeup, but that will hurt our public order and squalor. Which I don't necessarily want yet. That would be really nice to get that extra bonus for uh, all of our other incomes here. But it can wait. And what are we doing right now? We are selling slaves. Good. What's our slavery down to? Four. Uh, let's do one more turn, and then we can change that to something else, something more useful to us. Now, actually, what we ought to be doing here with these guys, just in case, let's recruit some more barbarians. This is what do we got? We got one Hastati. Uh, we got a couple of Ligurian skirmishers. Let's get another couple of units of Hastati. Oh, we can only get one. Yeah, because the manpower is all kinds of screwed up here. And I would actually rather have... Yeah, more of the Ligurian Spearmen. Ugh. So many barbarians in one legion. Uh, okay. Uh, here's the other thing we're going to do is... Let's strengthen this legion as I said I would do. Now guys, we are very close to reforms and I think we're going to hit it this uh, this episode. So, alright. Tariski, Axman, yes. Let's get a couple of them. A couple Hastati. And let's get some skirmishing power. Oh, Romanized Ligurian skirmishers. Excellent. Yeah, and they are better than our levies. By far. So we get a couple of them. And some archers. Alright. A lot happening here guys. Okay. Are we ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Consequent. Okay. So we sent Decimus Gabinius Dento. And he trade, betrayed us. Penalty to all income from trading. This guy insults me time and again. Oh my god. Okay, so we did research the Roman unit upgrades. I did that ahead of time. Yes, Polybian military reforms. Okay. <clears throat> Get ready, story time. The wars of the past decades and our continual bouts with Italian forces have somehow proven fruitful. As the influence of Roma grows beyond its humble Italian origins, our consuls have perfected manipular tactics. The old hoplite phalanx replaced by three lines of maniples sorted by age and experience instead of class and wealth. The young Hastati, backed up by older, more heavily armed principes, followed by the veteran triari and reserve. Our military has also adopted some of the armaments and armor of our enemies, their utility proven by the mercenaries of the uh, Poini, Poinii and the warriors of the Celte. Our soldiers now carry Pila, javelins, and Hastati and, Prin and Principes both have replaced their Haste spears with the deadly short sword, short sword we call the Gladius. Ah yes, the legendary Gladius. The older Triari, reluctant to change, still fight as a hoplite phalanx. Accenti and levies are no longer used. Well, uh, Valetes become the chosen skirmisher unit. New reforms usually open up new equipment and new ways of combat. Okay. Excellent. I almost feel better about this Gabinius guy. It's, it's almost cheered me up. Where are you? How is there no... No consequence for this. Uh, I'm sorry, man. I got, how do I put you to the sword? Maybe my wife can kill you? It requires two more cunning than the targets. Well, 
Oof, okay. Uh, let's see. What can I give her that gives her cunning? That gives her authority. Oh, please. Anything. Anything with cunning. Okay, well, we're not going to find it there. Oh, please. Anything. Well, let's see. Looks like we're going to have to just talk trash about the guy. Which that I can do. I'm I will shamelessly spread rumors about you. Okay, consequence. This character's reputation has been tarnished by the rumors that have been spread. But how? Okay, that reduced his authority. Oh god, I hate you so much. You, sir. Oh, God. I can set up a trap for him with the flirtation, but... Okay, we have bigger things to worry about. I'm not going to let this guy ruin an episode. Okay, we're declared to Lingi and Nori. That does kind of affect us. Uh, all right. Nice. Uh, Vipsanius. Plus four cultural influence. That's actually a really big deal. Okay. So, with him... Now, having that, well, maybe it doesn't uh, kick in until the next turn, but... Culture. Characters. Nine. Influence. Excellent. Alright, so right after I did a bunch of recruiting, we get our Polybian reforms, which is great. Okay, we got Hastati. Uh, we got a bunch more barbarians up here. Tariski Axman. More Hastati. So, again, we got to be careful here when we upgrade because you know upgrades aren't always better all right we got a quartermaster we got an orator we got publican uh excellent and we recorded recorded recruited some more ships uh by marini and rietti what Oh, the red, he died. Okay, edict issued import food. Okay, we are now back in the positive. So we did barely dodge um, getting screwed uh, food-wise. Okay, I love this. So we are going from a Custodes Corpus Legate to Equites Consulares. Nice. And Principes, uh, let's do the reform unit and compare. Oh yeah, this is this is way better, the upgrade, because again, that's not always the case. But we are getting rid of a lot of spears. But okay, we are not getting rid of the uh, companion hoplites, so that's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and compare the Hastati. Generally better. Generally better. Okay, let's go ahead. Yeah, we'll upgrade them. Why can I not upgrade you? Oh, I can. All right. Um, yeah, that's pretty spendy. Anything else? Okay, yeah, I don't have levies to upgrade to um, Velites. If you, indeed they even do get upgraded. Yeah, they do. Nice. See, that's more like the, the comfort... Rome unit that I know, like from back in uh, Rome 1. Uh, Equites are Equites late now. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade everyone we can. Oops. Let's do that. Oh, okay. That was only 49k. That's not bad. And we'll upgrade the general. Yeah, we're not getting too many. Replacements here. Eight turns to get... F oh, jeez. Are we drawing from... Okay, it doesn't matter. Anyway. Uh, Alright, that's upgraded. Uh, what about this? Lego 3 Italica. 
Are we upgrading anything different here? Nope. All the same. Nice. I cannot wait to see them on the field. That is going to be exciting. So, all right. For our next tech... Um, what I wanted to do... Well, not necessarily that one. Although these would be nice. Plus four sanitation. Plus three growth per turn. We really do need growth, guys. Our growth has essentially stopped. Um... But we do need this as well. And this allows us to upgrade our um, agriculture. So let's go ahead and get this done. And we'll get a bonus of plus three food for finishing all three in that tier. I'm happy with that. Now, let's go ahead and trespass on down here. Uh, we're not necessarily at 100% full strength, but it's damn close enough for me. Uh, let's get down here. Yeah, Syracuse, you, you guys can, if it's really that big of a problem, you can come out and attack me. I don't think they will. Um, Carthage is really, they're like crossing the street looking the wrong way here. Um, they are sending like unit after unit up over here to chase down Syr like Syracuse Navy and Epirus's Navy. And what they just did, you won't see it because it was during the turn, but they sent two units against uh, Epidamnos, and they lost. And it was very satisfying to watch. So, for our third legion, they are going to attack um, Corsica and Sardinia. So, let's get him moving over here, if we may. Oh, forgot to upgrade that. Nice. I even got a brighter, shinier horsey. Okay, so we are going to embark there. Let's get... That navy is strong enough to me. Because I want them to uh, provide some support to Lego 3. Or should I not get on land yet? Okay, well I can't get back on land, can I? <laughs> All right, well, we're just going to take casualties. I don't think it's really going to matter. We'll be able to attack that just fine. Uh, okay, now let's hurry up so we can get this war started. So we can get both uh, war with Carthage and... Oh, let's upgrade these guys. And our Polybian reforms in one episode. That is awesome. Okay, what kind of spy stuff can you actually do? Agent subversion... No chance that this is going to work, but you got to get experience somehow. Yep. You suck. And you should feel bad about yourself. All right. Uh, who else do we want to move around? No one. Oh, where was this guy going? Why did I... Oh, I forgot about... <laughs> My veteran. He's supposed to be a Legio 3 Italica. He's got some catching up to do. This poor bastard. He's over there hanging out with those damn Greeks. Alright. Hope he doesn't come back soft. Hanging out with the damn Greeks. They're real squishy. Uh, okay. Did we discover anyone new? I don't think we did. Oh. Oh. Hey, my spy gained a witch. Well, isn't that special? Okay. Uh, anything else I can do? The Equites have a full house here. So I am going to have to spread out uh, some of the next positions. Although, look, they're getting squeezed out. Can we do the Reformed Republic yet? No recent government reforms. Yeah, I... Why well, can... Uh, do we not have 10k? I, I think we might not have 10k. That's exactly why we do not have 10k. Alright, can we sell a treaty to anyone? Because that would probably... Give us a boon. Oh, go away. 
Nasus, do you want a non-aggression pact? Speak as you wish, no. Do you want anything danger. to do with this whatsoever? No. All right, you just hang out there on your island. Bastards. I do not like them. The Tolingi. They don't oh, like us, God. but I bet Let they'll trade. Nope. Okay, I know Syracuse is just uh, pretending we don't exist. I have little gain and can we trade with you? What you say. Okay, well, I'm not paying you for anything. I have the power position here. At least that's what I'm telling myself. So we have the highest relations with the Baturgis, which is neutral. Oh, that's not... Greetings. Okay, do you want a non-aggression pact? Will you give me money for it? Okay, no, we're just going to have to earn our money the old-fashioned way. And that is by Roman pillaging. Okay, rival banquet. One of the other parties has organized a banquet in your capital, threatening your hegemony. How do you react? Oh, I'm going. I'm going. You'll see me there. I'll be the guy with the big old biscuit. All right, what's this? Yep, agent exposed. This is, oh, really? How did you get experience? Well, I guess just by recruiting and leading men. All right, well, good for you. Um, ooh. I do want to pursue this one. It's plus two public order as well. Um, let's see what else we got here. Plus three public order. Plus three tax rate. That is always useful. We always need money. That would give us food. Reduce banditry. So let's actually do that one. No. Yeah. No. Okay, we're going to do public order and tax rate. Because that is what will benefit us most at the moment. Uh, let's see. Plus 6% tax rate. No, let's go for this one. Because this gives us research rate. Minus empire maintenance. Plus 2 public order. There we go. Nice. Alright, what faction? Don't care about these guys. Turduli. Very, very nice name. Uh, Andromedes. Uh, ooh, plus four campaign. Who got this? This guy. Yeah, I have to update his household items. Uh, what do we got? Uh, where is it? Oh, is that a skill? Where? Where are you? Let's see, what do we have on this guy? Okay. Plus two public order. We don't need that anymore. What would help us most now? Uh, yeah, Statuette of Mars. That's plus charge bonus, melee infantry attack. Great. And who do we have? Plus two public order. I forgot. We did all this public order stuff when we were using this as a... Uh, occupy, uh, occupation Legion. Alright. Plus four armor for all units. That's always useful. Uh, plus six morale. Oh, against raiding fleets. That's pretty specific. Yeah, we don't need that. Uh, let's see. Also an authority. Recover from wo wounds. Uh, let's do the shield bearer. For that extra armor. And this guy gives us cunning. Let's do authority and plus shots per minute. That is that is really what is going to help us. Alright. Good. Uh, what else? Uh, more household. Professional heckler. Um, ooh. Plus one cunning. Who got that? You got that. I thought I upgraded these guys. Okay. Um, good for you. Let's have a look at you. Can we get rid of that? No, we can't. So I was going to say, we could use that cunning. Or, um... Shoot. You know what I just realized? Sorry. We could use that cunning for, uh, to give to my wife to go kill our terrible Mr. Gabinius. Alright. Ambitious Magistrate. Nice. Okay. Good. 
All right, that guy's developing uh, a lot of really positive skills, and we are in the winter campaign season. So here's the thing, guys. Here's what I thought I might do. Well, no, you know what? If I attack Syracuse, I was thinking I might snatch Syracuse right out from under the nose of uh, Carthage. However, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to let Carthage take it. Because, look, they um, they annihilated the defender, the defending forces, so... Yep, that's going to be probably Legio 2 that takes on. Yep, oh man, we're just not going to make it there this turn. So I think they started to realize that uh, what it is that I'm doing. Now this is an army, a land-based army, that's floating out here. So what I could do, if I wanted to open this up, open this war up, I could sink these guys. I'd rather annihilate them on at the at sea than uh, fight them on land. So. Yeah, because look at this, generals. And who's this? Who's in charge here? Uh, Med Medulinus Fullo. Okay, so... He is an equity, I believe. Yeah, he is. Yeah, I don't really care that much about this guy. So, I think that is how we're going to open this up. I think I'm going to take out an entire 20 stack that's just floating around there. Uh, meanwhile, oh my god, that's as far as you can go. You suck. Uh, you know what? You guys are just going to have to take casualties then. You know what I need? Well, why why are you dying now? Oh, disease. F Christ's sake, man. You guys. You're all going to die and you're going to lose all that experience. So actually what we need to do is use this fleet as um, an escort. They need an escort fleet to avoid death at sea. Like, these guys probably are dying at sea as well, so we'll see. I always forget if the same rules apply for the AI. But, uh... Alright, anyway, let's check in on... Ooh, we're gonna get a library in Cisalpina next turn. And I think we can stop selling slaves here now. Is that true? Well, yeah, we probably should. And let's do Romanization. Oh, that's minus one building construction time as well. Which would have helped when we were actually building stuff. But uh, you know what? Yeah, for that one, that would take 10. I guess it'll take nine. That's, that's not bad. Uh, yeah, nothing we can do there. Uh, agents. Uh, let's make sure that all of our agents are doing what they must. This guy is roaming, making sure that the, this whole province turns Rome, right? Yep. And you're still terrible at it. Um, and what are you doing? Yep, you're helping to glue this place together. Uh... We're about to overtake the majority in culture here, and I think we'll be able to do that next turn. No, a couple more turns. All right. What about our spy? Can you do anything useful at all? Uh, no, we already tried the agent subversion. Can you do anything to their army? It only costs 300, so let's try. Kaboom. Wounded. All right, you know what? Just as well. He was starting to really piss me off. Anywho. All right, let's make our way down. Uh, actually, this way. Towards Carthage. Ebora. And can we steal food? Let's steal food. Don't need it, but sure. Uh, the Turduli. That's these guys? Oh, they're right here. Okay. All right, uh, we are good. So let's make sure. So yeah, guys, I hate to cut it short, but it looks like we are kicking off next turn, which is going to have to wait till next episode. So thank you guys for all your participation in this campaign. I am having a great time with it, uh, if you can't tell. And I hope you guys are too. So 
If you would like to get in on the action and have some influence on this campaign, uh, you know, within somewhat historical bounds, uh, please do come by my Discord. Uh, there's a channel there for the Roman Senate. I hope to see you guys there. I will see you next time. Mike Tannik out.